Soft tissue fillers are substances that are injected into the skin through small needles to improve the appearance of the face. They help fill out deep wrinkles, lines, and creases, including the nasolabial fold, marionette lines, forehead, and chin. They can also be used to plump areas such as the lips and cheeks. As we age, our faces begin to show the effects of gravity and sun exposure. Years of facial muscle movement, such as smiling, chewing, and squinting, take their toll. The underlying tissues that keep our skin looking youthful and plumped up begin to break down, often leaving laugh lines, smile lines, crow's feet, or facial creases over the areas where this muscle movement occurs. Soft tissue fillers such as Restylane, Juvederm, or Radius can help fill in these laugh lines, temporarily restoring a smoother, more youthful looking appearance. When injected beneath the skin, these fillers plump up creased and sunken areas of the face. Injectable fillers may be used alone or in conjunction with other methods of non-surgical facial rejuvenation such as Botox and chemical peels. If you're considering non-surgical facial rejuvenation, this video will give you a basic understanding of the procedure, when injectables can help, how the procedure is performed, and what results you can expect. It may not answer all of your questions, since a lot depends upon your individual circumstances. Keep in mind that as a plastic surgeon, I can offer you the full complement of the most advanced treatments available, ranging from cosmetic surgery, refinishing techniques, injectables, and the use of other fillers. During your consultation, we can discuss all alternatives, allowing you to select the method of rejuvenation that matches your problem and fits into your lifestyle. First, let's discuss Juvederm and Restylane. These are both hyaluronic acid-based injectable fillers, which can be used to fill in and improve the appearance of deep folds, lines, and wrinkles of the face, add fullness to the lips, and contour facial features such as the chin and cheeks. Juvederm is a smooth gel and comes in the following concentrations. Juvederm Ultra, injected into the middle dermis to treat glomerular lines, forehead wrinkles, cheek wrinkles, and mild to moderate nasal furrows. Juvederm Ultra Plus, injected into the deep dermis to add volume to the lips, sculpt the cheeks, and restore a natural oval shape to the face. How are these injections performed? A Juvederm injection is typically performed in our office and takes just 15 minutes to 30 minutes depending upon the size and number of areas being treated. A topical anesthetic local injection or nerve block may be first administered. During the procedure, the Juvederm is injected directly into the skin with a very fine needle. Sometimes light massage is needed to even the distribution of the product. While patients may experience some redness and swelling and discomfort for the first few days after treatment with Juvederm, recovery is minimal and most patients are able to immediately return to work and other normal activities. Juvederm results can last up to six months or longer depending upon several factors such as age and the location of the line. Hyaluronic acid is a natural occurring complex sugar found in all living cells, including the human body, where it fills the space between collagen and elastin fibers. In a cross section of skin, the upper layer or epidermis is composed primarily of cells. The dermal layer has only a few cells and is composed primarily of elastin, collagen, and many moisture attracting polysaccharides. Hyaluronic acid gel is one of these naturally occurring substances. Radius is a fine granule mineral-based product suspended in an absorbable gel medium. Because the body absorbs the carrier over a three to four month period, booster injections are sometimes required to obtain the final desired outcome. Radius is used for deep lines and creases. Since radius is based on a natural substance found in the human body and is not allergenic, so a test area is not necessary to be performed. Tiny needles inject the gel into the wrinkles or problem areas of the face. Radius microspheres are spitted within a gel carrier. The gel is replaced with a natural soft tissue providing scaffolding or tissue infiltration and growth. Radius can either shape facial contours, smooth wrinkles, or sculpt depressions. The final result leaves your facial features looking healthy, more youthful, and fuller. Injectables and fillers can shape facial contours, smooth wrinkles, or sculpt lips. Youthful lips have a one-third to two-thirds proportion. The cupid's bow is sharp and well-defined in a youthful lip. 
Youthful lips have full filtral columns that add upper lip to nasal base fullness. Youthful lips have a gentle concave slope, pleasing pouty appearance. The lower lip should project one to two millimeters anterior to the upper lip. Descent of the corners of the mouth and flattening of the upper lip are seen in aging lips. The final result of lip enhancement should be a youthful, natural, pleasing result. Botox, fat, and Restylane and Juvederm produce only temporary effects. Therefore, the number of treatments is determined by each individual patient. Complications are infrequent and are usually minor in nature. These are naturally occurring compounds, so there is little risk of an allergic reaction. Usually there is no downtime. You may immediately return to your daily routine. On some occasions there is redness or swelling. This temporary discomfort may last a few days. Do not use injectables or fillers if you have an infection at the site where they will be injected. Results will begin to fade and your facial features will gradually return to their former state. Before you have a treatment, be sure to make us aware of all allergies and all medications you are taking both prescription and non-prescription. To reduce bruising, avoid anticoagulants, aspirin, and other blood thinners for a week before treatment. Avoid vigorous activity directly after treatment and continue to avoid blood thinners until bruising diminishes. It is such an exciting time to be in the cosmetic arena because technology has moved along to give people who are interested in facial rejuvenation so many good options. I hope this video helps you understand the use of injectable fillers for facial rejuvenation. If you have any further questions, please let us know. Thanks.